More than 280 flights were delayed in Los Angeles last night, and at least 27 others were diverted when LAX descended into pandemonium because of a security scare. Maria Villarreal has the story. With guns drawn, LAX airport police detained a man carrying a plastic sword dressed as Zorro. Minutes later, chaos. Get up and go. Stand up and go. Police were flooded with calls about an active shooter and gunshots in Terminal 8. <laughs> Possible shooting just occurred one world way, one world way. I know a number of shots, no suspect information. The reports turned out to be false, but panic spread quickly to other terminals as well as on social media. Come on! Passengers ran in all directions, dragging luggage and carrying children to safety. All of a sudden, there was screaming around us, there's a shooter, there's a shooter, and everyone was starting to storm and run down the stairs, and it was just crazy. Some travelers ended up on the tarmac. Why are we running? Uh, security said to run. So. LAX Assistant Police Chief David Maggard says most passengers left on their own. These are difficult situations um, because there were multiple reports of, of something that was very significant and potentially very dangerous. Two weeks ago, another false alarm played out at New York's JFK Airport. Security expert Henry Willis questions whether the right protocols are in place to prevent this kind of mayhem. People left the airport in a chaotic fashion. They ended up exiting, in some cases on the tarmac, in other cases onto open roadways where they put themselves possibly in physical harm. And that itself is a breakdown in public safety. Things seem to be running smoothly here at LAX. In all, 281 flights were delayed and two were canceled. Nora, when the initial reports came in that shots were being fired here at the airport, the LAX Police Department was able to send out text message notification telling anyone within a five-mile radius to stay away from this area for their own safety. All right, Maria, thank you so much.